Hi, Timothy Unkert here, and in this video, I want to discuss the greater than or equal to comparison uh, symbol in C. Okay, so I've included a header file, and I have my main function, and I like to continue with my supernatural theme. So we're going to start with uh, const int, let's do Sam's underscore age equals 37, and Let's also have another integer age, and we'll have a printf statement, and we'll ask a question, how old is Sam at the end of Supernatural? My favorite TV show. Uh, and we'll scan f. Uh, we're scanning an integer, so I'm going to use the percentage d. And then I want to put... Uh, age, scan it into the age variable. And now I can use this greater than or equal to. So if I can say if age is greater than or equal to, and this is how we say it in C, uh, Sam's age, well, then we're going to have some code that's going to be executed. So we're going to print F, uh, your age guess was not lower than Sam's age. I know this is a little odd of an example, but uh, you know it's just demonstrating the greater than or equal to symbol. So that's the takeaway is this, okay? Greater than or equal to. All right, and at the end of this, we will return zero, okay? So I'm gonna open up a terminal here and let's compile this. Okay, and now let's run it. And how old is Sam at the end of Supernatural? Let's let's say 40. Your age guess was not lower than Sam's age. Let's run it again. And uh, if we say 36, then the program just ends because we don't have an else statement in there. Uh, but it's it's registering that hey your guess was lower, just we didn't give that option. Okay, and let's say we say 37, your guess was not lower than Sam's age. That's where the equal to also uh, works. Anyways, that was a little demonstration on C with a greater than or equal to symbol and how you use it. Uh, if you found this video interesting, please like, subscribe, and hit the bell for notifications as it really does help the channel grow. I thank you for watching. Hope you have a great day, and I hope I see you in the next one. Bye.